a beauty trend that you hope sticks around for a while. I'm still all about the highlighting. Like, I know some people are so over it, but I'm honestly still loving it. I'm like, I tried. <laughs> Hopefully it looks decent. Bold or everything? I wish it was more of an everyday thing. You could just be bold all day and no one would be like, oh my god, she's full on glam. I love the highlighter. Highlighter is meant to be here and it's meant to stay. I love faux freckles. I've been doing it forever, so I definitely would like those to stay. Winged eyeliner. I love winged eyeliner, whether it's like long, super long, or even like short, kind of like mine. It adds so much to the eye. I've been kind of into highlighters lately. I hope that crop tops stay around. I've been wearing crop tops since like 1995. Highlight, because like when the sun hits, it's like, whoo! <laughs> One beauty trend that has to stay is baking. It makes my makeup last like a lot longer. I have like really oily skin, so that's like perfect. I will forever love highlight. Highlight? Oh my god, that's my life. Something that I love is highlight. I love it when it's popping. <laughs> I'm always gonna be the girl that likes to bronze myself and, and have that glowy look. So I hope the, the glowy bronze look never goes out. The glitter. I love the glitter. The glitter has been like going around crazy right now. I hope that like dewy skin highlight just always sticks around because it's like my favorite thing. I know it's never going anywhere, which is lashes. I hope the cut crease stays around because I don't know, it's just so intricate. I can't do it. Oh gosh, no, I can't do it. But I feel like if it stays around long enough, I will be able to master it. Natural foundation, you know, not like hard contour. I love like crop flare jeans right now. I'm really into that. But I also really like uh, freckles. Like people are like drawing freckles on their face, which I really like. All the unicorn highlighters, like that's so cool. I love unicorns. I like the light makeup. I recently have gotten into that, although it's not as light today. The highlight, forever. I love the cat eye, the smoky eye. I love highlighter. Highlighter. Highlight. Glitter forever, please. I love glittery eyes, glittery cheeks, everything. Ooh. I love denim. I love denim. So Beauty, I like contour. I mean, I hope that one sticks around That's for a while. That's true. I like these kinds of shirts, like off the shoulder shirts. I hope they stay forever. Glitter. <laughs> I mean, I feel like it's always trendy, or it should always be trendy. Highlight. Love highlight so much. Highlighter? Oh, yeah. Lots and lots of highlighter. <laughs> I love me some gloss, too. Mm -hmm. Not wear some gloss, but makes your lip kind of poppins. I think what's trending now, obviously, are highlighters. And, and even everyone's still talking about contour. Now I got a little secret tip for everybody. I've been around a long time, and I've worked with a ton of huge celebrities. We were doing the contouring and the contouring sticks, but they weren't even called contour sticks, and highlighting many moons ago. But it is a trend now, and I think it's something that everyone should understand this is a staple you know it really helps give you know especially stars that fantastic bone structure so highlighting and contouring really should stay around I like to accentuate like my favorite part of my body I either pick my lips or my eyes I'm obsessed with lipsticks because uh, it's something that brings me back through childhood memories I always remember my mom with her lipstick on all the time all you need is a red lipstick on or whatever lipstick color you like and you're good to go. Cute like belts. Like everyone like needs belts. I hope those just like don't go away. What's a beauty trend you hope goes away? Really ridiculous like scrunchies. Like unless it's for like a photo shoot or something. Like people wearing like all black outfits, like cute outfits, then like big Barbie scrunchies. I'm like, girl, what are you doing? No, like that does not work. Fake freckles, even though I really like it, it looks cool, it's just like be yourself. Even though makeup can make you look like someone else, fake freckles or adding stuff, I just feel like can like stop. But I've done it before, so I don't know. <laughs> Dipping your face in a bowl of water, it gets messy, your hair gets wet. Too much like foundation and contouring. I think it's a beautiful look, but I also feel like there's something about having fun and then there's something about altering yourself too much. I'm kind of sick of bams. Everyone is wearing them. Like, there's a million other trainers you can wear. I haven't got a pair because, I don't know, I just don't want to follow the, the crowd. I gotta say the pom-poms. I think they're a little extra. I kind of don't like the fake freckles because some of some people do like, <laughs> like, when they make it too even so then it just looks like random dots. The sparkles. Like the legit, like full on sparkle, like, like sparkle highlight, like glitter, yeah. glitter like highlighter, day. yeah. <laughs> Those matte lips, like that, uh, that crust. I love the fact that they don't transfer so I can kiss my boo, but I don't like how it makes my lips look super flaky. So give me like a semi matte with like a dab of shine, like a moisture matte. Since I have put it eyes, the very heavy liner, because this is like colorful, okay, but those are just like too much. I, I don't love it because it doesn't work for my eye shape. Lip tattoos, like I don't like those things. Like what is that? <laughs> I don't love Birkenstocks. I just can't get down with it. I can't get down with my little feet having imprints in on the leather. 
So I'm done with that. Seven layers of foundation because that's so expensive and my pores hate me. The two-toned lipstick, I feel like it's been there for a while. The crazy stuff that people are doing with their eyebrows now, it's like the feathered and the points. It looks really good on certain people, but I actually experimented with it in my bathroom the other day. I was like, I'll never be able to pull this off. So I need that one to go away. LED lashes that just came out, I don't like them at all. Girls thinking they need to pile makeup on their face to be trendy. I miss like the 2013, 2015 era of makeup. It's like 2016 to like 2017 and it's more drag. And I feel like girls are covering what they naturally have. So I feel like that trend should go. I high like clear boots. Like, I mean, I've never tried them, so maybe, but I feel like I've seen them a lot. And I'm like, okay, I feel like that's gonna die really quick. Nose contour, cause I can't do it. Crazy filled in eyebrows. My eyebrows are filled in right now, but like, People who like go so hard, that's a trend. I mean, bold brows are a trend, but it can get a little crazy. Low rise jeans, I don't even know if they're in style. I tried one on the other day and I hated it. The low cut jeans. I was reading they might come back. No, I don't want those to come back. I want the high waisted jeans to stay.